Alden, red corner. I'm expecting a lot from Fur Alden. He was very confident going in. Oh, nice right hand. Good speed from Jagger, as he said he would be. Back and forth at the moment. Likes working down to the body, Jagger. Really fast he is with his shots. Oh, good combination. He's making his debut here this evening, and uh, so far he's making a good account of himself. I like that he's thinking, he's looking for his shots, moving his foot, working in and out, hands with that right hand to the body. We did expect more from Jay Farrandon. Perfect control. Really nice. Jagger, only 20 years of age. You know, he's playing a smart game here. He's looking to land these shots to the body. And then I would expect him to, when that body wears down, fake it and bring it up to the head. Oh, good left hook from Farouden. He has to be more active. Threatening to come in with the footwork for Alden. Just got to let the shots go. Heavy right hand over the top. Looks like he's got the power. Beautiful body kick. Beautiful high kick there, landed on the glove though. The end of the first round. You know, I actually really enjoyed that first round. It's a lot slower than the other fights we've seen this evening, but I like Nori Dijerga. He's working very smartly. He's got a good eye. Look at the movement as well. His footwork coming in, moving out. I like the way he's working to the body the whole time. Jay Ferrand and he just not letting his shots really go at the moment. Don't know if he's wary, but the shots I have seen him throw, he does hold some power, so I would like to see him unleash it. He is the more experienced of the two fighters for Alden. Second round for the second round. At the moment, he's letting uh, Jürgen just take control. I do like his style, though. Let's see what round number two brings. Here we go. Fast. Really fast. And again, that right hand to the body is just really sinking in. Beautiful jumping knee, landed, split the guards off for Alden. Nice left hook lands. That's what he's got to do, not give him too much respect. He's letting Jagger just set up, basically. Beautiful, backing him up into the corner, trying to keep him there. 
back it down to the body, trying to get those guards to drop off for Rowden. Brings the high kick up high. Rowden's got nothing to lose. He has to just let his combinations go. He, just, he doesn't seem to know what to do as well when that right hand's coming to the body. He should just shoot a knee up through the center. Jagger is uh, dipping down, trying to throw that long knee. But his hands are fast. Jagger. You don't know if they are coming to the body or the head, to be fair. Beautiful left hook. kick comes in very quick hard inside low kick just dominating this third round really as he's done in the first and second Dijerga said he wanted to put on a spectacular fight and prove that he belongs in this infusion ring. He's from the team Dijaga, so a family affair. Controlling nicely, looks for that left hook to the body again. Rowdham just being a moving target, really. You know, when he lands that, he throws that right hand, it is connecting. Frustrating, he's not throwing it more. So if you just joined us, we are in Sealand, in Netherlands. It's the first time we've ever had a show in Sealand, and it is such a nice venue, such a nice city. We are sold out this evening. The locals are very happy to have Infusion here, and we are number 135 Infusion show. Nice left high kick. 
good work last minute. Forty seconds. I mean, Jagger is having his own way, and he's using the shots really nice. He's only up twenty years of age. His power is going to even grow over the next few years, and I look forward to watching him fight even more. Hopefully, good left high kick. off with the low kick, chopping down to that muscle, spinning back kick. When the end of the third round. A great performance there from Nori De Jagger. As I say, I am a little bit dis disappointed in the performance of Jay Ferrauden. Like he <laughs> promised us so much. He wanted to get his arm raised. He was going to knock his opponent's head off. It just wasn't his night this evening. We're going to have a look at the highlights. As round one started, really, that's how it followed throughout the rest of the rounds. Jagger working that body shot so nicely. You can see the speed there. Kept the distance control. Looping uppercut worked those well. Entering into round number two. I mean, you can just see his head movement as well here. As I said during the fight, it'll be great to see him against an opponent who kind of gives him a bit more of a challenge. Good combinations, landing with that low kick to finish many of them off. Nice to watch. Well, first of all, ladies and gentlemen, a big applause for both fighters, Nuri de Jager and the Jay for Alden. When after three rounds of three minutes, we've counted the points and we have a winner. And the winner, ladies and gentlemen, is the man in the blue corner, Nuri de Jager. So congratulations to Nuri. Well, of course, also your again. appreciation for his opponent, uh, Jay Verhouten. So we're going to take a very quick break. Make sure you join us straight after. We have one more match for you. Robbie Capitime, a local to Sealand. I'm sure he's going to and his fans blow the roof off the venue here.